Hello, all you wonderful lambs everywhere in the world. Today, I'm going to be praying against any type of witchcraft that's been directed your way by witches and warlocks that are praying against you. So, I'm going to be praying against the spirit of witchcraft and I'm going to be inviting God to deal with the witchcraft by releasing the power of the Holy Spirit and His anointing and the blood of Jesus against all witchcraft power that rises up against you in the spiritual world through human agents of the devil, through witches and warlocks, because the devil always worked through human vessels to do his evil works of darkness. So today I'm going to be praying against this witchcraft for God to supernaturally intervene and to deliver you from the witchcraft and the spirit of witchcraft and from witches and warlocks and from witchcraft attacks and to protect you from witchcraft attacks in this episode today. So take tune in this episode and I thank you all listeners out there that are listening um, to this podcast this Spreaker all my show podcast shows and throughout the whole four years and through this present time and I ask that all listeners will continue to listen and support my Spreaker podcast shows through all Spreaker social networks, as well as Spreaker, through Spreaker. And I ask that you can share my episodes and like them. Give me some likes. And also that you will subscribe to me through Spreaker or other social media platforms that come through Spreaker. So I appreciate so much your listening support and your listening ear. So, stay tuned, and I will pray. Just a moment, I'm going to put on a song, Renew Your Mind, by Martin Andrew Smith, which is an instrumental song, and he does a lot of wonderful uh, instrumentals of spiritual uh, Christian songs in instrument form, beautiful melodies of piano plays. So, I hope any of you that enjoy Listen to Martin Andrew Smith. We'll go out and buy it and support him in www.bandcamp.com. And I will have that on the subscription bar underneath this episode for you to go uh, support that, his music, if you desire to. So anyway, I'm going to pray with the help of the Lord and the leading of the Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, I just ask that you guide and direct me in how to pray against this witchcraft that so many of your children and so many of the persecuted lambs are being afflicted with by witches and warlocks that harass them with witchcraft every day and that also operate in the spirit of witchcraft to dominate, to control, to intimidate, to bully your people and the persecuted everywhere in the world through these different types of modern day slavery programs and outside of these different types of modern day slavery programs everywhere in the world. So I ask Holy Spirit that you will lead me and guide me in this episode today, How to Pray. Because, Holy Spirit, you're the only one that can help me to pray. And you know how to pray the perfect will of God, Holy Spirit. Thank you for your help. And I thank you, Father, for helping me and leading me how to pray through the Holy Spirit against this witchcraft. And I ask for your supernatural intervention, Father, to put an end to this witchcraft upon many sufferers that are suffering through the harassment of witchcraft attacks by witches and warlocks that's harassing them with witchcraft every day. Because I am going through the same 
thing every day with witches harassing me with witchcraft. So I want to pray and I'm led to pray at this prayer video today by the Holy Spirit, Father God, and by you, Father God. And I thank you for delivering your people and the persecuted from all types of witchcraft. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Now I pray. I bind up all spirits of witchcraft, sorcery, divination, incantations, and evil altars and covenants that rise up against your children, Father God, and the persecuted everywhere in the world from children to adults. In the name of Jesus Christ, with your chains and your fetters, in Jesus Christ's name. I command that all spirits of witchcraft, control, manipulation, domination, intimidation, totalitarianism, coercion, usurping, overridden spirits be arrested by the Holy Spirit and by your angels, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. I ask, Father, that you release the Holy Spirit and your angels to arrest the spirit of witchcraft that rise up against your people, Father God, everywhere in the world, that rise up against the persecuted everywhere in the world, that these demons of witchcraft, sorcery, divination, incantation, and control, manipulation, domination, intimidation, coercion, usurping, totalitarianism, Goliath spirits, be arrested by the Holy Spirit and your angels, Father, and that you will sing the Holy Spirit and your angels to arrest these evil spirits of witchcraft and all cluster spirits that's working with the spirit of witchcraft against the lives of your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world, that these evil spirits of witchcraft will be arrested by the Holy Spirit and your angels, Father God, and that your angels will send this demon spirit of witchcraft to eternal prison, where Jesus will send this evil spirit of witchcraft and all cluster spirits working with the spirit of witchcraft that rise up against the lives of your people and the persecuted everywhere in the world, Father, in Jesus Christ's name. I ask, Father God, and I command, Father God, that you release your chains and your fetters, Father God, to bind up the demon spirit of witchcraft, control, manipulation, domination, intimidation, coercion, totalitarianism, go lie spirits, that's working with the spirit of witchcraft, the spirit of intimidation, that's working with the spirit of witchcraft, the spirit of control, that's working with the spirit of witchcraft, Father God, against the lives of your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world, Father God, that your angels will bind up these demon spirits of witchcraft with your chains and with your fetters upon them. In Jesus Christ's name. Father, I ask in the mighty name of Jesus that you release the fire bombs of heaven from heaven to burn and destroy the works of darkness, working for the spirit of witchcraft, Father God, with the fire bombs of heaven, Father God, down to the ashes, to the ground, to not, that you release your holy fires to consume and to destroy all witchcraft, Father God, activities, curses, hexes, vexes, jinxes, and omens, sorceries, divinations, incantations, Father God, evil altars, that your consuming fires will burn and destroy all witchcraft activities and all witchcraft curses, hexes, vexes, jinxes, and omens. Father God, sorceries and divinations, incantations, and evil altars, and evil covenants, and evil ancestral covenants off of the lives of your children and the persecuted lambs everywhere in the world, Father God, down to the ashes, to the ground, to not. In Jesus Christ's name.
I pray, Father, that you will release the blood of Jesus Christ, Father God, to destroy and to dismantle, Father God, all witchcraft, curses, hexes, vexes, jinxes, and omens, Father God. All evil altars, sorceries, divinations, Father God, incantations, satanic bonds, demonic bonds, undue hardship, Father God, proclivities and captivities, Heavenly Father, evil circles, evil eyes, evil eye curses, astral projection, witchcraft, black magic, voodoo, hoodoo, Santeria, Satanism, Father, Dark Masonry, Masonic Witchcraft, Father God, Evil Masonic Logics and Oaths, Father God, off of the lives of your people and the persecuted everywhere in the world with the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name. I ask that you release your anointing, Father God, and your power and the power of the Holy Spirit, Father God, along with the blood of Jesus Christ to dismantle and to break and to destroy all witchcraft curses, Father, hexes, vexes, jinxes, and omens, through all types of witchcraft off the lives of your people and the persecuted everywhere in the world, from children to adults everywhere in the world, Father God, with the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name. I ask that you release the blood of Jesus Christ to dispel every evil altar, sorcery, divination, incantation, every evil prophecy, every evil decoration and decree, Father God, all coven witchcraft, Father God, is released by witches and warlocks against the lives of your children and the lives of the persecuted everywhere in the world. Father God, with the blood of Jesus Christ, that you will lease your whirlwind. Father God, against the head of all witchcraft that's being released against your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world. In Jesus Christ's name, that you will send your angels to shut down all witchcraft camps and houses, Father God, witchcraft cars and witchcraft apartments and witchcraft altars, witchcraft covens, Father God, and covenants and secret society places and Masonic lodges, shrines and bohemian groves. Father God, in oceans and sea of the coast, Father God, in the graveyard, Father God, and in the woods, Father God, in all secret society places where any witches and wizards are praying against your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world with the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name. I pray, Father God, for your supernatural intervention, Father God, for you to supernaturally intervene, Father God, and send your angels in aid to deliver your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world to shut down all witchcraft camps and houses, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, to shut them down and to destroy them with the fires of the Holy Spirit. In Jesus Christ's name, down to the ashes, to the ground, to not. In Jesus Christ's name, Father God, I ask, Father God, for you to supernaturally intervene to convict every witch and wizard, Father God, that are that are harassing your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world with any type of witchcraft, with all types of witchcraft, Father God, that they be arrested by the Holy Spirit and arrested by your angels, that every witch and wizard would be arrested by the Holy Spirit. And that you will spiritually tag every witch and wizard that's harassing any of your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world with any types of witchcraft, with all types of witchcraft, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, that these witches and wizards will be convicted by the Holy Spirit and be spiritually tagged by you, Father, by your spirit and your power and your hand of 
direction and conviction that you would convict the hearts of every witch and wizard that's harassing any of your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world with any types of witchcraft Father God in Jesus Christ's name and that these witches and wizards will be convicted by the Holy Spirit and turn away from their wicked ways and repent of their witchcraft and turn to Jesus in Jesus Christ's name, Father. And I pray that you help these witches understand and know with your deep, with your deep um, rebukes, Father God, of convictions in the hearts of all witches and wizards that's harassing your children and the persecuted with witchcraft that their witchcraft is wrong in Jesus Christ's name. And I pray, Father God, that any witch and wizard that's praying against your children and the persecuted, Father God, that they will be convicted deeply in their hearts and that you will boomerang any type of witchcrafts and curses and spells to any witch and wizard that who refuses to repent and relent for harassing your people and your children with any type of witchcraft, Father God, that you extend no mercy on any of these witches and wizards that who refuse to repent and relent for harassing your children and the persecuted with any types of witchcrafts in Jesus Christ's name, and that you will suffer a witch not to live, Father God who refuses to repent and to relent for harassing your children and the persecuted with any types of witchcrafts. In Jesus Christ's name, with your judgment and your vengeance upon every witch and wizard who refuses to repent and relent for harassing your children with any type of witchcraft, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father God, because you are the judge and the only judge, Father God, and there is nothing but justice in your heavenly court and righteousness in your heavenly court, and you judge righteously and fair, Father God. And I thank you for giving a fair judgment to the witches and wizards who refuse to repent for harassing your children and the persecuted lambs with any types of witchcrafts, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father God, and Father, I just pray in the name of Jesus Christ, Father God, that you will heal any of your children in the persecuted lambs that are being harassed by witchcraft, Father God, by witches and warlocks and any of your lambs that have been wounded by witchcraft, Father God, and things have been destroyed in their lives behind witches harassing them with witchcraft and destroying everything in their lives in Jesus Christ's name and that you'll restore everything that the devil has stolen from your children and the persecuted lambs everywhere in the world Father God through witchcraft Father God in Jesus Christ's name and I pray Father that you will leash your angels the Holy Spirit to arrest all spirits of stealing, killing, and destroying that come against your people and the persecuted that operate in the lives of your people. These demon spirits of killing, stealing, and destroying that's also working with the spirit of witchcraft against your children and that operate through human agents of the devil, Father God, that want to destroy, kill, and destroy things in the lives of your children and the persecuted lambs everywhere in the world. In Jesus Christ's name, I command that these spirits of stealing, killing, and destroying be arrested by the Holy Spirit and by your angels, Father God, and that these spirits in Jesus Christ's name of stealing, killing, and destroying, Father God, will be sent to eternal prison, be bind up with the your chains and your fetters, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus, that you will send your angels, Father, to bind up the spirits of stealing, killing, and destroying with your chains and your fetters upon these wicked spirits that rise up against your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world, Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And I pray, Father, that you release your angels of justice, your angels 
Father God, a restoration to restore everything that the devil and his demons have stolen in the lives of your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world. Father God, through witchcraft attacks, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, through witches that have prayed so much witchcraft against your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world that's being harassed by witches. I pray that you will also deliver your children and the persecuted from witches and wizards and spiritual spouse demons, Father God, that you will send your angels to arrest spiritual spouse demons succubus and incubus demons and ancestral covenants of spiritual spouse demons generational curses and family bloodlines of your children and the persecuted father God that these spiritual spouse demons will be arrested by the Holy Spirit and your angels and be bind up with your chains and your feathers and be burned and destroyed by the fires of heaven, by your consuming fires down to the ashes, to the ground, to not. In Jesus Christ's name, Father God. I thank you that you are a God of restoration and you're the God of deliverance. And I pray that you will release your angels of deliverance to deliver your children and the persecuted from witches and warlocks that are harassing your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world with witchcraft attacks. In Jesus Christ's name, Father God, and she will deliver your children Father God, from spiritual spouse demons that's harassing them, that where witches have formed spiritual spouse demons with upon them through witchcraft to control them and to destroy them. In Jesus Christ's name, that you will break these evil spirits of spiritual spouse off of the lives of your children and the persecuted. Father God, everywhere in the world, in Jesus Christ's name. And that you will break all witches and wizards off the lives of your children. The control grip of witches and wizards off the lives of your children. And the persecuted everywhere in the world. With your power and your anointing. In Jesus Christ's name. That you will leash your anointing upon your children. And the persecuted lambs everywhere in the world. To destroy every yoke and remove every burden of witchcraft. And every burden of the control of witches and wizards controlling and dominating your children in any given area of their lives, their minds and their bodies, through V2K mind control, through witchcraft control and that you will also release the blood of Jesus and your power and your anointing to break the strong yokes of demonic dreams off of the lives of your children by the God that's being placed upon your children and the persecuted lambs by witches and warlocks, Father God, with the blood of Jesus Christ to break and destroy these evil altars that witches are forming against your children and the persecuted lambs through their witchcrafts, Father God, and their dark sorceries and divinations and potions with your holy fires the blood of Jesus Christ that you destroy every satanic evil plan of demonic dreams and altars off the lives of your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world that are being harassed by witches that are cursing them with demonic dreams through demonic dreams and harassing them through demonic dreams during a moon phase per week Father God with the blood of Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus Christ and Father for this Halloween coming up Father God in a couple days Father that you would deliver your people and protect your people from witches and wizards Father God during this Halloween season Father God in Jesus Christ's name Father God that all Halloween witchcraft will be destroyed and dismantled forever off the lives of your children and the persecuted lambs everywhere in the world with your power and your anointing with the power of the Holy Spirit the power of Jesus Christ with the blood of Jesus Christ Father God the power of your anointing Father God, that destroys every yoke and removes every burden of witchcraft off the lives of your children and the persecuted lambs everywhere in the world, Father God. In the mighty name of Jesus, 
Father God. I thank you and I praise you, Father God, for delivering your people from all types of witchcraft, sorceries, and divinations. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I give you glory and honor to your holy name. Thank you, Father, that this prayer is done, and I ask that you cover this prayer and this podcast, this episode with the blood of Jesus, and that you cover all your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world, from children to adults, with the blood of Jesus Christ, from the crown of their heads to the soles of their feet, and that you will cover them with your shield and hedge of protection and your complete full armor and your glory shield covered with the fire of the Holy Spirit Father God to will off all witchcraft to burn and destroy any type of witchcraft arrows and fiery darts of witchcraft sent against your children and the persecuted by witches and warlocks especially during this Halloween season and after this Halloween season Father God with the consuming fires of the Holy Ghost down to the ashes to the ground to not in Jesus Christ's name and I pray that you cause all the snares of the devil and trappings of the devil to be destroyed in the lives of your people and your children Father God the persecuted everywhere in the world with the fires of the Holy Ghost down to the ashes to the ground to not in Jesus Christ's name, and that you will let the table of the witches that pray any type of coven witchcraft against your children and the persecuted everywhere in the world to become a snare, and that you release confusion upon the witchcraft networks, Father God. The blood of Jesus Christ, that no witch and wizard will be able to prosper in the, any environments where your children and the persecuted lives, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, Father God. I thank you and I praise you for causing the table of witchcraft to become a snare upon the witches around it. In the mighty name of Jesus, with your judgment. And with the judgment blood of Jesus Christ, the chastisement of the blood of Jesus Christ upon and against this witchcraft in Jesus Christ's name. And I ask that you execute your judgment and vengeance and punishment and wrath upon the devil and all his demonic cohorts, Father God that rise up against your children to harass your children with any type of witchcraft because it's nothing but demons operating through the witches to cause the witches to harass your children and the persecuted all over the world with witchcraft, Father God. In Jesus Christ's name, the devil is behind this witchcraft 100%. And the devil is the one that's working through witches to harass your children and the persecuted with witchcraft, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. So I thank you for bringing your judgment upon the devil and his demonic cohorts, Father God, for harassing your children and the persecuted lambs with witchcraft and for harassing me with witchcraft in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And I thank you for putting an end to this witchcraft that you will send your angels to adjudicate and eradicate and put a perpetual end to this work of darkness, to the wickedness of the wicked, to the wickedness of the witches that come against your children and the persecuted lambs with harassment of witchcraft, Father God, in demonic dreams and control and manipulation operating in the spirit of witchcraft towards your children and the persecuted, Father God, everywhere in the world through these different types of modern day slavery programs and outside of them, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ's name, amen.